you can go to Google and type QGIS download. The very first thing that you will be getting, you have to click on that link that says download QGIS. Click on that, scroll down, you see what operating system you have and accordingly you can check for the version. So this is Windows version showing the download files for the download files for mac os the download file for linux and all so as we mostly have windows so uh, you can click on qgis standalone installer version 3.16 uh, as your uh, windows will be 64 bit or 32 bit accordingly you can select one of them so as mine is uh, 64 bit so i just click on that and you can see here the file is getting downloaded we'll right click and save show in the folder so this is my setup so here my setup has came now I will just double click on it you see it is handover version so it's asking me to make changes yes or no so i say yes make the changes to my device i click on the next button then there's a license agreement that is there you can read the license agreement and then click on i agree it is asking me to select the destination folder I just browse to my D folder because I don't want it in my C drive. So I then uh, after specifying the destination folder I click on next button. So by default the QGIS is uh, checked. Uh, we don't want to add any more data sets to it you can also add them but for now I don't need it so I just click on install it is getting extracted all the files are getting extracted and the installation is proceeding we'll wait until everything gets extracted and installed the installation has finished so I will click on finish I'll just click on let's get started it is setting up the GUI it's restoring the plugins the QI the QGIS is ready